I don't drink wine, but I'll keep the cork. Really? So somebody threw out these bottles of wine, and now you're gonna throw them out again. You're just gonna take the cork. There is gonna be a very happy hobo somewhere that's gonna stumble in here for a burger and hit the jackpot. What's up guys, and welcome to Crazy Vacation. This is another one of those point and click adventures from Carmel Games. And honestly, the only reason I'm playing it is because of this dude's face. I've been laughing while setting up this recording for like the past five minutes. I don't know what it is. It's just such a fu- I, I feel like an idiot saying that this is a really funny face, but he looks like a constipated Muppet and it's killing me. I'm sure it'll be a fun game, right? They always are. Hello, sir. We are thrilled to have you here in our beautiful and relaxing hotel. I completely forgot about the voice acting. I voice acted one of these games. Why does that surprise me? Relaxing? My room is facing a giant red neon sign. I can't stay in that room. He's exactly as nasally as I would have expected. Why is he wearing pink pants? Yes, it is the new restaurant across the street. Why don't you draw the curtain? There are no curtains! I want a different room! I'm sorry, sir, but we don't have a different room available for you at the moment. Crazy Dad is about to go crazy! <laughs> what? I guess this guy's name is Crazy Dad, and by the sounds of it, he's a few sandwiches short of a picnic basket. And our objective is to turn off the giant flashing sign outdoors, I believe. Okay. <laughs> and then straight back to the face. Now, as with all these point and click adventures, we need to take our time and look around. It looks like we can go outside, we can go upstairs, we can go to the pool, uh, we can click on this. Had a lovely time, thanks. Pepperoni. <laughs> Had a great holiday. Lot of zits. Okay, uh, you know what? Crazy Dad signing there probably won't stand out too much. We got this, this thing. Hotel's fire escape plan. Hotel's fire escape plan. All right. Uh, I can't do anything, so I'm not actually playing this. So we start here. We need to get out there. So we will go up, left, down, left. Up, up, right, up, left, left. Are we gonna be able to remember that? I'm not gonna be able to remember that. Hopefully I don't need to escape a fire. Uh, okay, good to know. We can click on him, he's not gonna give me a room. Uh, we can click on the safe. There's, there's no numbers here. What on earth kind of safe is this? Oh, wait, it's Probably corresponded to how you would get out of a fire, right? So we would start here and go like this, was it? Uh, up, over, over? Aha! I remembered it! I have the memory of a goldfish. I'm actually really proud of myself. Okay, so we got that. Is there anything else here? We got a duster. Why are they keeping a duster in a safe? How about we go upstairs and scope out the issue? Okay, yeah, that's definitely a problem. Sleeping like that not could be very comfortable. We can click on this. Place a record in here if I want to get this gramophone to work. Okay, we need to find a record. Uh, we need to find a code for this safe. I don't think I've seen anything like that yet. Uh, anything else? No. Probably don't need to. Oh, maybe I can use the duster on that. It doesn't work. No. Okay. I was maybe we could dust for fingerprints. I don't know. What's going on outside? Let's, oh yeah. Why would that be a good sign? It's a burger. What kind of burger just flashes red? Don't understand. Nothing in the garbage for us, nothing in the gutter. Uh, there's an arcade next door, and then there's this restaurant. Maybe we just ask them to turn it off, right? Uh, oh, we can click on the wine. Somebody threw out these new bottles of wine. I need a corkscrew to get them open. Again, I just catch a glimpse of his face and his mouth doesn't move. God damn it. Threw out their new bottles of wine. Okay, so we need a corkscrew. Don't touch it. What? Don't touch it. Okay, calm down. Hello, sir, and welcome to Belly Maker. What can I get you? One off sign, please. I want you to turn off that freaking neon sign. See, now his mouth moves. Obviously, I'm not going to do that. Would you like to taste our overpriced burgers? Crazy Dad is about to go crazy! 
I can't get over this stupid catch line, man. Crazy Dad is about to go crazy! See, they should have gotten me to voice act this one. Could have easily nailed it. Okay, we can go into the arcade shack. Uh, what do you got Hello, to say? Hello, sir, and welcome to our world-famous arcade. Check out our machine. You can win cool prizes. All three of them. World famous. That that's a very world famous garbage can over Fine. there. I'll look around. Okay, yeah, we'll we'll look around. All right. Um, space I shooter. Need a coin to play this game. You can find a coin. Sir, that machine is broken. Please don't touch it. Ooh, okay, we might need to fix that one with like a screwdriver by the looks of it. Anything else? No. Okay, so we need a coin, a screwdriver. Uh. We do any ooh. That sign is driving me insane! No no, it's driving you crazy! What's going on with our window? That's my hotel room window. Okay, we, we confirmed that is the issue sign. There are not two giant blinking red signs. So we have a target. Uh let's see if there's anything to help us in the pool. Um there's a large man hanging out. Oh, there's a screwdriver. There's a screwdriver in there. But if I try to reach in with my hand, I will explode! I will explode! I don't know why it kills me. Okay, so, yeah, probably don't reach in the bear trap. We, we can not do that. Hello, I'm Crazy Dad. Who are you? His name actually is Crazy Dad. Like, no space. It's like Captain Sauce. It's just, why? Why wouldn't there be a space? Because there isn't. Don't ask questions. Hello. I'm a very upset guest. This pool is leaking. I see that. This is a poorly maintained hotel. Yeah. And that's why I'll trash this place. But until then, can you do something about the pool? Maybe. I'll keep you posted. Okay. So we need to- The pool is leaking. This is the most catastrophic hotel I've ever seen. Okay. So we need- Uh, uh I can't even- We need a lot of stuff. We just need to look around. <laughs> oh, hold on. I think I found something. That's the door. That's the sign. So I can click on the wire? The wire goes all the way across the buildings. I wonder what it does. Okay, so maybe we can screw with the wire at some point if I get some items. All I have right now is a duster. I need to find some excuse to use a duster. I'm still not sure how to get into that safe. There are a couple of numbers here. Both of them are 30 slash 4. So maybe 304 would be the code? We can go try that. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, there are more. Very nice hotel from a uh, rickety ladder. Best vacation ever from uh, Pepsi Cola. <laughs> Enjoyed from Polly Dent. And the best place for relaxation from Hill to Climb. Okay. Oh my god, there's so many of them. What is this? I found an item! Okay, so maybe, maybe 304 is the code. We have a coin though. Oh, we can go to the arcade with that. Right, uh, I needed a coin to play this, I think. So if I do that, oh, here you go. Your goal is to find the matching cards and discover them all. Click anywhere to start. Oh, I used to love these games growing up. I remember this used to be like the bonus thing for uh, Super Mario. Was it Super Mario 3 that had this? That was always great. Uh, oh God, his face is here. Why is his face here? Have we met her yet? Maybe his daughter? The nose is very similar. <laughs> Candy and bear and the best for last. There we go. Got there. Uh... Oh, I got a ticket. Okay. Hello, sir, and welcome to our world-famous arcade. Check out our machine. You can win cool prizes. Cool Fine. prizes. I'll look around. Okay, well, I got a ticket. Can I turn that in for something? Give it to what you. What can I get for this? You get a record. One ticket for one coin wins me a record. I don't know about you guys, but here you might get a uh, Chinese finger trap. Um, I don't know, a Pez. Not a Pez dispenser, just a single Pez. Now that we have the record, we should be able to go up to our room and drop it down on that. And I wasn't totally sure why that would do something, but it seems to have spit out... Uh, Oh, I thought this was a scratch ticket, but it looks like it's... Oh, it's the code to the safe! So, apple, apple, apple is 30. Apple, banana, banana is 18. Banana, coconut, banana minus coconut is 2. Okay, so hold on. Apple, apple, apple is 30, so apple is 10. 
If apple is 10, then banana is four. So four minus coconut is two. So coconut must be, oh no, that's two coconuts. So coconut must be one. So one plus 10 plus four. Does that make sense? One, 10, four times 10. Oh God. So one plus 10 is 11, 150. Uh, is that right? 150? Oh yeah. Once again, we have to ask ourselves the question, why are they keeping a corkscrew? Yeah, why are they keeping an old corkscrew in the safe? Then again, we do need an old corkscrew, right? So now we can go out here, we can use this on the boss of wine. wine. But I'll keep the cork. Really? So somebody threw out these bottles of wine, and now you're gonna throw them out again. You're just gonna take the cork. There is gonna be a very happy hobo somewhere that's gonna stumble in here for a burger and hit the jackpot. So now that we have a cork, and we still have the red note and the duster. What will we need? Oh, the cork can probably plug the hole in the pool, right? What if we do that? There, I fixed the pool. Yay! Marvelous. Here, have this wooden stick. I was saving it to bash this place, but I don't feel like doing it anymore. Your reward is a wooden stick. Thank you, sir. Wooden stick. Do we just throw it at this? Okay, don't ask questions. We got a wooden stick, great. We got a screwdriver. Now we should be able to use this to get into the arcade machine, right? This looked like it needed a screwdriver. Aha. Oh, what is this? We don't have any more num- Wait, is this numbers? Do we need- Oh no, wait, this is um, Sudoku. I never played Sudoku, but I do understand how it works. So you need to have one, two, three, and four in every single row and column. And uh, you can't have like, it gets a little bit complicated. So like, this can't be a four. This has to be a three. And then this has to be a four. Because we already have one and two, and you can't have four lined up with four. Okay. This cannot be a two, so we're gonna leave that a one. What if we make this a three and this a two? Then you would be four. You could be a two, uh, a three to make you a two. Oh man, am I at all right here? Three, three, no, I screwed up somewhere. Uh, what if we, mmm, this is always, I hated these. This is why I don't play these games. Oh no, wait, I think I do have it, right? I'm just screwed up because there's two twos here. So if this is a four, then this would be a two. Okay, I'm better than I thought. I don't take a lot of joy in those puzzles because they frustrate me, but a four by four is pretty simple. So what did we, oh, we got a big old string of tickets. A thousand tickets. If I got a record for one ticket, I better get a house Hello, for a thousand. Oh wait, I don't want to hear your ring around here. Just take my tickets. I know I can win cool stuff. Just, just what take them. What can I get for this? You get an axe. An axe. What? Oh, an axe. Wait a minute. I can probably use the axe here. The wire was not connected to the sign, but I bet something else has happened. Okay. What would that have been connected to? Something oh. is wrong with the network connection. I better see what the problem is. Oh, he's gone. Okay, let's rob the place. No, I can't do that. I won't touch it with my hands. There are cobwebs all over the lever. Oh, okay. Uh, what if we just, there we go. That sounds like a very intense sign being turned off. Something happened. The sign is off! I won! I finally won! <laughs> I won! That face just screams victory! Oh, crazy dad. Good news. I've got another room for you. Oh, the people just straight up refer to him as crazy dad. All one word. That won't be needed. I solved the problem myself. But we already moved your luggage to the new room, and we gave your room to another guest. Here's the key. It's room five. I'm sure you'll love it. Okay, but I want my record out of that other room because I went through a lot of trouble to get it. It's worth one whole coin, and I'm probably gonna break into the other dude's safe. 
Just say it. Crazy Dad is going crazy! <laughs> I'm done. But that's gonna be it for crazy vacation, guys. You know, I didn't really have very high expectations for this game. They're never overly complicated, they don't have high production values, or they're not very long, but they're silly and enjoyable. And it's like I said, this guy's face was enough for me to take enjoyment throughout this entire game. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I'll keep an eye out for more point and click adventures. I know people always want to see more. And if you have any recommendations, be sure to leave them in the comments. But thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.